this video, I'm going to show how to hold the fan in your hand correctly. So when you, when you go to hold the fan in your hand, it's going to be along this line of your hand, and it's going to hook into the base of your hand. So when I lay it in my hand, it's the base is connected to the heel of my hand, and then I'm going along the diagonal, and then my thumb and pointing finger are pinching the fan. The, uh, re the rest of the fingers are very loose and light, and just grasping the fan easily, because they're going to have to be able to move easily. And this is why it's so important that when you hold the fan, you hold it lightly but firmly, and avoid the death grip. If you get a really tight death grip in it to make sure you don't lose control of it, you won't be able to open the fan and close the fan easily. Now once we open the fan, all that's holding it is the, again, the pointing finger and the thumb pinching the first time. And then it's resting, the base is resting into the heel of your hand. So that these fingers are just light. They'll wrap loosely to help stabilize it, but won't actually be holding any weight. So you want to be able to hold the fan very loosely and lightly so that you can open and close the fan. Now, during the, the and this is one of the things about the unique characteristics of the, of the fan is your hand will constantly be shifting positions on the fan. There's many different ways you will hold the fan. There's the kind of the stab club way, where you get ready to club or stab or hit somebody. Opening the fan flat, sometimes you'll open the fan and your hand will be straight up as well as the fan, and the thumb will be grasping the, like this. And then you have to be able to shift the fan to another position as you go. So you have to be able to get used to the fan and trust yourself not to throw the fan with practice so that you can hold, open and close your hand as necessary. So what happened when I, I delayed my opening of my hand, because I was thinking about it too much. So, that is how you want to hold the fan. It's diagonally down your, your, your hand, the base is connected into the heel of your hand, and most of the work is done by your pointing finger and your thumb, pinching the fan. And that is how to hold the fan. If there's any unique positions that come up in the form, I'll discuss those unique positions inside the form.